Not long ago, my five years old son has seen the advert of IMO Z6. And when I asked him, would you like to try one, he said... <laughs> and he was all over the moon. I'm out, I'm out. Welcome back, this is Adam and you're watching Family Pop TV YouTube channel. Today we're going to do a tech review of this new IMO Z6 smartwatch. In the box is the watch itself a USB-A to proprietary magnetic charging clip, a few simple instructions and that's it. There's two color options on sale at the moment, a green shaded arrangement and a purple one with pink accents. We have picked the purple one and I thought it might be too girly for a boy but I was mistaken, it doesn't look like a girl's watch at all. First thing, Z6 isn't just a smartwatch, it's nearly a full featured smartphone in a watch sized form so the nano sim card is required. IMO Watch Phone Z6 currently supports 3G and 4G carriers with most mainstream operators in the three regions of Europe, North America and Asia. IMO support team is working on making watch phone compatible with more operators across the world. I have installed the EE UK Nano SIM card. I was surprised how easy for use and intuitive it is, yet how powerful. My son is 5 years old and without any manual he was able to pick up its functionality without any help in no time. IMO is new to the game, having been around since 2012, they spent the last 5 years or so focused on kids watches and in the Watchphone Z6 they've reached a 5th generation product that's really quite usable and ready to go. It's got a decent side 1.41 inch AMOLED display running at 320 by 360 pixels which does the job even in the direct sunlight. IMO Z6 is completely waterproof, weatherproof and dustproof. That means your child can have a swim while wearing Z6. I like it. The built-in camera allows to make a video calls. The watch has to be flipped so it stands at the wrist so the camera is pointed at the child's face. There's also a rear camera which allows to take a photos and children can show you where they're looking at during the video call. How it communicates really, really well. Like most other kids' watches, at home it uses the Wi Fi connection, and outside it uses 3G and 4G carriers networks, as mentioned earlier. There's a companion app to be installed on your mobile phone where all the settings can be done. Several features can be enabled or disabled which gives you full control over what your child will use on Z6 and it works on both iPhone and Android. For example, if all the features would be disabled, that would preserve the battery life and it will turn Z6 into a fancy looking watch with very basic functions. The main features on IMO Z6 include setting a pre-approved contact list with photos so your kid can call mum and dad and all their siblings or anyone else. You can lock the phone to only these contacts. For older kids, let them dial other numbers too. You can also restrict inbound calls to your pre-approved list or to let the world in. Anyone not on a pre-approved list just gets hung up on and your kid will never know. For clarification, it can call and receive any normal calls exactly as normal mobile phone. For video calls, you have to use the app and it's very simple to use. Open the app and click the video call. Done. The video calls using the data and the data is cheap. There's a chat app as well, so kids can send you an emoji or audio message and you can reply the same, as well as sending a text message back. There's no keyboard for your kids though, so chances are you'll get an audio message back. 
Location tracking so you can make sure your child is where they meant to be and if they're in trouble they can call you and you'll see where they are to go help. It's pretty accurate too. The user interface on the watch itself is based on Android where you would probably not be able to tell most of the time. You can swipe left to access the contacts and right to access the number of apps. Swiping down reveals notifications such as missed calls. IMO Z6 also offers a pretty high degree of customization. For example, you are able to change its watch face from the Z6 menu. And here, these are called themes. And there's a selection of them available to pick and download instantly. You can also create your own customized watch face. And that's doable through the app in the photo wallpaper menu. You can take a photo or choose the existing one from your smartphone, load it, crop and zoom it as you want, then name it and save it within the app so it's ready to be synced with your child's Z6 at any time. Simple. The Z6 uses point score system where your child gets points for many activities, for example reaches daily amount of steps. Once the certain amount of points been reached gets level up, this will allow to compete with the other children who are having Z6 as well as it brings some extra perks. There's also a class mode which allows to define your child's class time and its duration from the IMO app to set it up. During the class hours the Z6 will act like a regular watch with only access to emergency calls. With the class mode there's no need to worry if your child uses the watch phone frequently and getting disturbed during their class. The last thing worth mentioning is the battery life. We tried before Vodafone Neo which has to be charged daily. In Z6 the battery is very good and it lasts up five to four days between charging that depends obviously on how much the screen and features are used I reckon when most of the functions are in the restricted mode the battery will last over a week on a single charge the price might seem a bit high but believe me for what it does you will struggle to find a smartphone watch as useful as Z6 for a similar price you see, it's not just a smartwatch, it's an Android Power wearable that is almost a full-featured smartphone in a wrist-sized form factor. One thing is for sure, a smartwatch, or actually a phone watch, doesn't change good parenting, but it can assist. If you're planning to buy this one, there's an Amazon link in the video description. Okay guys, that's it for today. If you enjoyed our video, please give us a thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing to Family Pop TV YouTube channel. I'll see you next week. Adam, Family Pop TV.